Hello everyone, welcome to electronics workshop. Today in this video, we are going to see how we can order PCB with SMD from one of the best PCB manufacturer, GLC PCB. First of all, go to the project folder and open the PCB file of the project that you are going to order. Once, check all the placement and component before ordering the PCB. If everything is okay, go to file and fabrication output where you can find the option to download the Gerber file. Before downloading the Gerber file, I suggest you to make one Gerber folder in your respective project folder so that you can easily zip your Gerber file which helps you while ordering the PCB. Here, I created a folder called Gerber where I download all my Gerber file inside. The PCB manufacturer also needs the drill file, so I generate the drill file and plot the Gerber in the respective Gerber folder. Once it is done, go to Gerber folder and check whether all the Gerber file along with the drill file are present or not. For the SMD PCB, manufacturer required position file. For the position file, go to fabrication output and component placement. Make one separate position folder in the respective project file where you can plot the position of all the components. Once the Gerber and position file are created, our final requirement will be bill of material or bomb file. For that, go to the schematic of your project and click on the table. Here, you can see all the components used in your project. First of all, group it by LPN and select the field that you require in your bomb file. In my bomb file, I require reference, value, footprint, LPN, that means GLC part number, MPN, which means manufacturer part number. GLC PCB has also given the standard format for making the bomb file, which contains comment, designator, footprint and GLC part number. I usually make a new spreadsheet in Excel. Go to my schematic and copy all the used components from the table. Once I copy all the components from the table, I paste it back in the created new spreadsheet. After then, I must rename all the reference with the corresponding reference name provided by GLCPC.
after creation of bomb file, save the bomb file to a specific project folder. While copying from the table, if arrow symbol is present in your designator, remove your arrow symbol from the designator. Open your position folder from your project folder and change all the reference according to the reference provided by GLCPC. For getting the discount coupon, go to my website by clicking in the link provided in the description of this video and click on the banner of GLCPCB. You can directly go to glcpcb.com if you do not want any discount. This is the official website of GLCPCB. For ordering the PCB, go to order now and upload your garbage file. We have already downloaded our garbal file in our specific project folder. So go to the specific project folder and upload your garbal file. It will take little time while uploading the garbal file. You can also check your garbal by going to your garbal viewer. This is the top side of your PCB. You can watch the 3D view of your PCB by going to the 3D. If you want SMT assembly in your PCB, check this button and scroll below. Once you confirm it, the manufacturer asks bomb file and position file to be uploaded. We have 
already generated our bomb and position file and modify it according to the requirements of our manufacturer that is GLGPC. Now we go to file any specific for project folder and upload our both bomb and position file in the respective position to be uploaded. Once you upload all the file, click on next. Here you can find all the components used in your SMP assembly. In this page, you can view the SMP overview of your PCB. You must watch this part very carefully. If you found any position mistake of any of your components, you can change the bomb file. You must take care for especially for electrolyte capacitor, diodes, and equal pin ICs. We must also check whether the starting pin of all the IC is correctly placed or not. Here the starting point of all the IC is denoted by red dot. Now you can shift to card to make an order. Here you can view the total charge of your PCB and SMT product. After secure checkout, you must place the correct shipping address. And once the payment once the payment is done, your PCB will go in the process of manufacturing. 